Hello everyone and welcome back to our Adventure A Day quest calendar from Sundial Games 2024, The Leaf Riders of Renwood. Now, if you missed out on last week's, uh, don't make sure you go ahead and check the link above. I should have linked to either last times or the whole playlist. Now, last week was pretty crazy. We investigated down the hole, uh, checked around the insects and met with their king, drove him away, came back, healed up the hole. There was a whole lot going on. We fumbled a lot. It's pretty crazy. If you missed it, make sure you go back and check it out. Um, this week we had a vote between what new dice to choose. We had cloud blue, see-through yellow, uh, blue and yellow, and then purple and orange. Yeah. So uh, with your votes, the dice for this week is going to be cloud blue, one of my personal favorites. Uh, I know it may be a little hard to see on camera, but I will do my best to show you and let you know what happens. Now, that should bring us to this week's adventure, where we are playing as Tack, if you forgot. Tack Redwind. Go ahead and reset all our stuff. Oh, man. It only gets crazy from here. <clears throat> yeah, this is just a little bit of what happened last week. So that brings us to today, Monday, February 26th. I can already see there is a hack right here. So for those who remember or forget what happens when there is a backpack icon on the page, throughout the calendar, there are some days where you'll find hidden treasures on the page. These days are noted by the following icon, the backpack. These icons may not always be easy to find and may be hidden on the page. Keep an eye out for them. If you spot the icon, roll a D10 and then consult the table. Now, the D10, if you remember, is this top looking die. And that is going to be a six. Six is going to give us a nimble cap. So we'll go into our inventory and add a nimble cap wherever that is. I don't think I've had one yet. There it is. Nibble cap. Consumed on use as a D4 to a single dexterity roll. That makes sense. Nimbles in the name. All right. It has been a long day and you need to rest. The residents of Crown Spire City continued celebrating the Turning Leaf Festival into the night. But you seek the comfort of a nice bed and warm meal to finish the evening. You've been, you've been excused to tend to your wounds, but you've been asked to return in the morning for a debriefing and counsel. All right. So it says, take a rest. Yep, take a rest, restore your health to full, restore the health of all party members to full, rege regain all expended use abilities, regain all spells points, remove the poison condition and curse condition, Change your equipment if you desire. You can't have two of the same item types, helmet, gloves, etc. Equipped it at the same time. Change your party members if you desire. Remove a single negative modifier caused by a wound. If you have a wound against both strength and dexterity, pick one to restore. If you died twice and got a wound to strength both times, fully restore your strength. So we're going to go ahead and hit our take a rest. We are rested. We are at full health. And I believe that'll do it for Monday. So thank you all for joining us. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed or are in, I hope you all are enjoying this adventure as much as I am. Uh, make sure you like and if you like what you're seeing here, it helps us out. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. It'll let you know when more of our wonderful videos come out. Also, if you like D&D &D and RPGs in general, we do stream uh dnd every wednesday and every other sunday we just had a sunday adventure for tomb of annihilation make sure you check the vod out for that if you haven't um also uh chat isn't moderated on youtube so if you want to talk to me you can always come over to twitch i am parkless on twitch but thank you all for joining us and yeah until next time as always stay safe out there